Hi, everybody. It's me. Just a couple of things I want to talk about and answer a couple of questions. First of all, I want to apologize because on Monday I was with Mel. <laughs> you guys asked about Jamie Raskin and I went totally blank and so did he. <laughs> Jamie Raskin, of course, one of the greatest people in the impeachment and He's the one that lost his son to suicide. He just got over cancer and I went totally blank and I'm so sorry. So, so sorry. Um, but yeah, now I'm back on track. I also want the people who donated, uh, well, not donated, but they gave me their their uh, names and stuff because I no longer, am, you don't book with me for reading, so. I, I named off a bunch, but I definitely am working on that. I swear to you, I'll get that done. Um, what else was I going to tell you? And of course, Alioto, just as Alioto. So anyway, he got caught fishing with a big time Republican donator who's part of something. Da, does this surprise you? Does it even surprise you? But let's just take a look, see. He was like, oh, I didn't even know he worked. Yeah, right. Right. These guys are going to really be sorry for a lot of stuff they did because, because of what they did and how awful they did it. America is fighting back. And now they're even putting through a thing to up the numbers in, in the Supreme Court to 13. Uh, they won't get it done while they, Congress still has a couple of whack jobs, but they will get it done down the road. So, and tomorrow I'll be on Andre's channel. He just uploaded a video. I still have to watch it. Sometimes it's so hard to be able to watch things. I tell you guys. Okay. Let's see about Justice Aliota. Anything, any repercussion because of this? Fishing. <laughs> Did you see those fish? fishies they got? They were huge. Yeah, he's trying to bow away from it. It's causing him a lot of stress, you guys. He's taking it harder than um, than um, Thomas. Okay, so, oh, God. You know, initially, they acted like whatever, but they are struggling now, I'm going to tell you right now. All kinds of energies headed their way. He's... <sighs> Him and Justice Thomas are looking at the calendar, which means they're both looking at when they can retire. If I, if if Trump got in again, they'd leave, both of them. But Trump's not getting in again. But I don't see any legal ramifications. I see just like with Thomas. Thomas's wife is the one that's going to create chaos for Thomas, where he might have to step down. Remember, I always told you he was going to step down because of his wife. So, um, uh, yeah, there's no legal things here. There's no jail cell. Sorry, you guys. Will they actually come up? Because somebody was saying, you know, Supreme Court is a stickler for details and you better be on time and you better do this. So they've got to be a stickler for themselves too. So let's take a look. See, come on. Will down the road, the Supreme Court have to follow rules and regulations? Someone's showing me them being very careful. Down the road, they will. It's a new beginning, okay? Lots of stuff. It's it's a, a lot of drive. People will be driven to say no more. We gotta we gotta do this right. Here's another woman getting on board. Um, and they're holding on tight. They're not revealing the truth about a lot of stuff. There's more to come, you guys. So it's not. See, we're gonna have to wait for a little bit. 
here's the communications. See, when the angel of light comes in, justice will be ours. And I think when the new administration comes in and they have a lot more seats in the, in the senators and the Congress, it's going to happen. It's, did you hear about, well, I don't know if it's true. It's hearsay. Entertainment purposes only. But apparently Lauren Bobert told MTG off. She said, you know, I took care of you for so many years and you're such a B, you know what, biosh. And you stole my idea about impeachment. <laughs> so anyway, but this tip for tat's not going to work for them. She, Bobert's not coming back. MTG will go more towards next year. I'll look at it, but Bobert's not coming back. Okay, so that submersion vehicle with the five people in it. When Mel and I looked at it, I definitely felt it was over. I heard they heard noises, but God forbid if they're, I would rather it implode, you know what I mean, than sit in there knowing. Can you tell me about that? Oh, the sun is here. Either that or they all went. Didn't they say five people? Five people looking at the sun? They're really desperate above. They're trying to get to them. Um, You know, that guy that started this thing is in trouble. Someone complained about this thing that it was not safe, and he got fired for complaining. And you can't open it up from the inside. It has to be opened it up from the outside. Yeah, it's not good, you guys. Um, it's very hard, very hard. I see that younger guy, like the father that's with him, really is upset. But once they, you know, this, there's the coffins. I'm going to tell you right now, it's 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 sad news. But remember, don't be afraid of death because they're they're not dead but they've transferred. So, okay. So you guys sent me some questions. Oh, and thank you guys. A lot of you guys are saying, Linda, you don't need to apologize. Yeah, Jamie Raskin was a big one. And Mel and I both went senior citizen. Uh, before the indictment for Trump was out, this is from Vicky. He took his plane to properties in the UK and Republic of Ireland. Since there are still some boxes unaccounted for. Oh, they're all over. They're in Scotland and Ireland. I'm going to tell you right now. Absolutely. You guys keep writing, no apology, no apology. You guys are so cool. <laughs> That's most of my stuff. Okay. Will Jack... This is half courage. Will Jack call Cannon as a witness and therefore she will have to be recused? I just heard no. Cannon. Well, Jack. No, no, but justice is coming, you guys. I don't want you to worry. It may take a while. It may take a while, but it's coming. She's going to get stuck. Like, She's going to try to look like she's doing right, but there's something sneaky going on here. And everybody's going to be cheering. I don't know what Jack's going to do, but they're going to love it. Victory after burden, you guys. Justice will be served. And don't you worry, because there's so many things coming up. I My guides even told me when someone was saying, well, you know, she'll probably, she can say, forget about it. He can't be charged. It doesn't matter what she says, because the bottom line is he's going down. That I can tell you. 
Okay. No apologies, no apologies. <laughs> you guys are so nice. Uh, I'll probably do live this weekend. So I wanted to apologize about that. Are you going to, <laughs> Emily said, are you going to apologize for being too bodacious? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Is Putin ever going, this is from Anne. Is Putin ever going to experience any consequences for all the destruction and harm he afflicts on the world? Absolutely. It might not be while he's in human body. You know, and we can't wish it on anybody. As, as terrible as a person he is, just tell the realm. They will handle it. He has things that he needs to uh, can't be accounted for. It's not for us to wish it or hope it. We just handle ourselves and the way we think about it. Because the atrocities are, are terrible. And some of the hits I've even got on Hitler were pretty extreme. He has... He has gone back into a body, but but he's come back as uh, it, it, it's pieces of love. Ruth Montgomery talked about that, that they come back and they're, you know, born with without a brain and they're shown love for a minute. People sign up for it and they have to keep coming back and starting from the beginning, if you know what I mean. But um he will, you know, and just like with Trump, all of us are like, yeah, we want him, you know. It's so exciting when this stuff comes up, but he's, I'm telling you, did you see on the news this morning? His numbers are gone down, was it 6%, six points? His numbers are dropping. I think it's just getting unbecoming and people are tired of the chaos. And trust me, to Satan won't win either. But in a way, between us, I would rather he ran for president because I know for sure he's going to lose. I know for sure. Okay. Can you tell us about the disclosure of alien life? Penny. Will it change how we treat each other? Will we realize where religion went wrong and its understanding of God? Well, you know, Kenny, um, they talked to me one time. Do you remember a lot, uh, maybe a year or so ago? I actually got an alien energy. I could see his form. And he told me they were there to protect us from blowing ourselves up. And that we need to get on board as far as helping this earth remain livable. And we're close right now. And there's some changes that are going to happen earthwise. Shifting is occurring, but they are here. And the mo the only way they can interfere is no um, nuke, no nuclear. Okay, so I talked about the, the, the uh, it's not a submarine, it's a uh, submergible. Yeah, I, I'm feeling, uh, Jamie asked, are you still feeling, yeah, I'm not, as soon as I heard, you know, I got to go with the first thing. As soon as I heard that guides told me, like, it's done. Like, they, you know, but they did say they would find or find out what happened. So. Um, oh, I need to have Tom come back. You're right, Sam. As soon as I get done here, I'll write him. Uh, I'll see if he's available. He's, he's such a nice guy. Uh, um, okay, so Clyde Malabox said, he's got a personal question, but the reason I'm going to answer this, because this goes for everybody, that his grandson transitioned April of September 10th, April 9th of 2010. Warning if he has any comfort light and absolutely it's so funny we as humans see how kind you guys are even for me when I said I need to apologize. Oh, don't even worry, don't even worry. 
how could we think that an omnipresent energy and or God would be horrible to a young energy like that? They His transition, he is in the light. And they, they, you know, like when I go to wonder about things, I, I see that nobody has to worry over there unless you're Hitler. <laughs> you don't have to worry. It's it's a beautiful thing. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so that was my son. Sorry about that. You got scared the bejesus out of me. Um, the document case, how deep is the damage? This is from Lynn. Oh, it's bad. It's bad. And we're going to be talking about this long after he's gone. This man did some horrible things. And isn't it amazing how they're all up in arms about Biden? Uh, son uh, only getting, a, you know, a slap on the wrist. They're saying other people with misdemeanors like that, first time offenders, wouldn't even get what he got. It's It would be a lot lighter. But, oh, you know, that okay, so he gets to be treated different. Hello, who do you got over there taking top confidential records? And you're saying, oh, well, we, you know, so don't worry. And did you guys see the Durham thing that he testified? He looks so, it's terrible, you guys. They wouldn't look at anything with Trump. So you were told that Russia, well, yeah, but we didn't investigate it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Hello. We all knew that. Um, isn't it so sad? KD just said, and KD said, submersible. Oh, you guys are so cool. You guys. Uh, what is a walk-in? This is Linda. Was my partner of 10 years who recently died a walk-in. His daughters and friends kept telling me how much he changed being with me. He was like a different person from the one he had been, more tolerant and open-minded. I feel he was. You know, Abraham Lincoln was a walk-in. Remember, Abraham Lincoln was close to suicide. And he he had a severe depression. He still carried some of it. But Ruth Montgomery says Abraham Lincoln was a walk-in. And if you think about it, he totally changed and then he went to it in a different direction. So he did what he needed to do. And I feel that your uh, your boyfriend was a walk-in. Sort of saved his life before he crossed. So you were a good partner. Uh, Sherry, she said, a group is asking CRTC in Canada to remove Fox News. I think they will remove it. I'm not sure when, but I think they will remove it. Let's see, this one's telling a little story. Crosa, when my children were small, I lived in New York City at my parents' house with the second oldest child and a friend. My son said his name was Yokohama. It was a little boy who would visit him in his room. They slept. The little boy said he and his parents died in a plane crash. His parents would sometimes appear to my son as well. The thing that made me nervous was that the little boy wanted my son to go with him. Oh, God, I'd be nervous, too. My son was the only one that could see them. I feel this family did die in a plane crash. It was absolutely real. He was wishing the child could go with him, but he couldn't. You know, they have no, no ability to make him go with him. He was not evil at all. But I definitely feel a plane crash. So, um, okay, D Dakota, is Mike Lee, the Utah senator, getting caught up in the coming January 6th cleaning up of our government? I absolutely say yes. Okay. Uh, no apologies, no apologies. A lot of people asking about the sub. Did Sterling have a chance to see the photos I took of Sedona? That might be a UFO. Oh, this is Mary. That's more personal. I'll have to contact her. Um, 
everybody's asking about the Titan, which is so sad, you know. Remember when those little boys got stuck in the cave? Um, in a different country, I can't think of the name of the country, Indonesia or something. And then those guys went under and they did this big long thing to kind of knock the kids out and one by one took them out. Remember what I said? I said each one of them was going to get out alive. But I couldn't tell you on this. I'm so sorry. I hope I'm wrong. Oh, Jane just said, please don't tell me that Donald is completely innocent. <laughs> Otherwise, I can't imagine what you would need to apologize for. Oh, God, no, girlfriend. You can take it to the bank. Um, how many of the screen court are compromised? Four. Geez, almost the whole five. I just heard four. Will Trump or his lawyers eventually plead insanity? I feel when you know what hits the fans and we're getting more stuff, that's what's going to happen with him if he doesn't kick over. I just feel he's just going to be babbling. Uh, oh, this is a good one, Christy. My question is, after DeSat Satan is no longer running for president, will he go back to being governor or will he just go away? I see him going back to being governor and then he'll go away. He he doesn't even have a chance to try again in four years. It's just he's got his, his numbers are dropping. Nobody in Florida likes him. Will the Federal Trade Commission, this is Johnny, finally ban non-competes? I don't know what that is, Johnny. I'm so sorry. I'll have to look it up. Oh, too bad I'm not live. Ask me when I go on live this Sunday. Okay. Will Cash Patel be indicted for January 6th in the doc? Yes, absolutely. Melania, where is Melania? Helen asks. Um, she's in New York. Um, oh, and I wanted to tell you, I did the prayers. I accidentally put members, but I changed it. I put it to public. It still won't link as public. So I'm so sorry, you guys. When I'm going to ask my son who just called and I'll call him back to see if there's some way I can. He knows everything about everything. Get it on there public because I did all the prayers today. Uh, Linda, if you don't see Trump going to jail, um, Wendy, I never saw them throwing him in jail. But I see some sort of seclusion, something going on, uh, like he's medically unfit or something. He's not going to be able to go out there and talk trash about everyone, everybody anymore. Uh, 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 Tweet City. No apologies necessary. Can you tell trajectory of Merrick Garland's position? He's doing good. But I'm almost sensing the second time, you know, when Biden wins again, he might not be there. Maybe he'll go to the Supreme Court. But I'm not seeing, uh, he might even say this is too much for me. Uh, sweetie darling, what, Linda, whatever are you forgiven? Okay, thank you. What does Kennedy clan, especially Ethel, like about Robert? At the clan, the sisters have even written, we love our brother, but no. They they don't, They it's like he's lost his mind. And he's not a medical doctor, so I don't know what the heck he thinks he's doing. Um, do you think we'll flip on Trump? Oh, who do you think will flip on Trump? I don't see Melania, but I think Ivanka will. And there's some more coming up. Yeah, James just said, I really have a bad feeling about the submersibles carrying five people down. 
I wish you were wrong, James, but I, like I said, Monday on Mel's show, I said, it's not good. Okay, you guys, I can only do this a little short. I'm making dinner for my son, then it's the doggy's time to eat. Gee, they didn't come running. <laughs> I love you all. I'll talk to you soon. Uh, tomorrow is my mediumship three card pull. And then uh, I think I'm doing a couple of guests. Oh, tomorrow I'm going to be with Andre too. Love you all. Cheers. <laughs>